Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel Mystic Holistic. I'm your host Dr. Bhupa Papar and today we're gonna do a quick general tarot reading for the month of August 2022 for the sign Capricorn. Remember these are general readings so they may or may not resonate with all of you. However, if they do, don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel. Also for the full picture, don't forget to check out your sun, moon and rising sign as well. So Capricorn, what's we, what do we have for you in store for the month of August 2022? Let's get started and understand. Okay. A shuffle. Okay. Just gonna make sure that all the cards are visible for you all. Okay. I'm gonna put an angel message for the month of August to understand uh, if there are any specific things that you need to focus on for the entire month or what the overall energy is going to be for the month of August. So what does Capricorn need to know for the month of August? Okay. So you've got the card of wisdom. I'll read out the message for you. Knowledge is learned, but wisdom is divine prompting within you. Your angel guidance is to connect to your still quiet center and listen to the wisdom of your soul. Then you will take decision and act on your own infinite self. With wisdom, life takes on a new perspective as dramas and fears become insignificant in comparison with the magnificence of the overall picture. Walk your path in life as one of the wise ones and all will revere and respect you. The affirmation for you is I listen to my wisdom. That's a very lovely message to have. So somebody is very wise in the month of August Capricorn. So let's get started with your general reading. So in your recent past, you've got the seven of Gabriel or seven of wands. Um, some of you might have recently stood up for your own belief system. Um, you've shown very, uh, shown confidence. You've claimed your personal power uh, and you're, you're moving on from there. You know, you're no longer entertaining the drama of others for sure. And because you were able to claim that confidence in you and you were able to stand up for what you believed in, you are now moving into your current energies of Ace of Raphael. So there is an absolute new emotional beginning that is there for you. Some of you might be entering into a new relationship, probably, or, or probably you're rekindling the romance in your relationship as well so people who are already in a committed relationship are now taking their relationship to the next level or people who were not committed in their relationship are finding new love coming their way as well so definitely an emotional experience that's coming your way now this emotional experience doesn't have to be with respect to a lover it could be a new friend that you are encountering with it could be a new new relationship or you know with probably with your mom with your dad just you're trying to rekindle that relationship at a new level where where that entire emotional need is getting fulfilled for you mm, some of you i feel that you might be getting yourself a new companion probably a pet a new pet that's coming your way as well because these these new beginnings are more emotionally driven 
and there are deep lasting spiritual insights that are coming your way you're you're being driven a lot with your emotions there are a lot of emotional aspects coming in because i see a lot of cups energy over here a lot of water energy is over here so definitely some water sign probably is coming your way as well in let me just quickly clarify the ace of a file Oh yes, it's the judgment card. So definitely your good karma is paying back and you are getting what you deserved for, you know, you probably... It's your good deeds that are coming back to you for sure. So you've probably done some good things in your past that's now reaping the benefits and now you're being rewarded for all your good deeds so that's the judgment call day that you have for you and that's that's the new emotional experience or emotional or fulfillment that is coming for you definitely so absolutely a beautiful relation to begin with and these this is with the divine intervention so it's not something that you are driving it or you know it's not just a mere coincidence this is something that is given to you with divine intervention with taking into account what you have been doing so far so you really need to be thankful for all these new experiences that you're getting for yourself uh, in your recent future you've got the king of Ariel, so definitely your plans are working out really well uh, there is a lot of professional and financial success for you um, it's a card of stability it's a card that also suggests that you need to use your resources wisely. Um, the clarifying card with that is Two of Swords. So some of you are still in two mindsets or have feeling that indecisiveness where you're not able to take a decision around some financial things. But there is definitely a professional and a financial success coming in for you. Probably some of you might be encountering two offers coming your way. And then there is a decision that you need to make which way to go or which offer to opt for. Uh, if you are applied for a new job probably and there are two offers that are coming your way. If you are getting into a new business venture, there are two two different uh, offers that are coming your way and you're tr still in that state of confusion as to which decision you need to make and I feel that most of you are still in in the phase where you know you just want to sit on it or sleep on it and wait for it to happen automatically well the, the thing is that you also have two of a file so that is another choice that you have to make that decision has to be made um, there are two dead two hearts dedicated to creating something beautiful and wonderful for you so definitely this new partnership that you're encountered or the new emotional be beginning that you have encountered both of you together are coming out as a power couple for sure and there, there is a there is a decision that both of you need to take together if you are in this situation hold on now this is this decision making is not going to be easy there is a little bit of a conflict that's going on between the two of you but i feel that with this you guys are meant to be together you know so you guys are gonna figure it out for sure as to what is the best win-win situation in this scenario but i would suggest that don't sit on it you know just take some decision around it do not wait because things are not gonna solve on on their own you need to make up your mind and you need to take a decision for you to move forward ahead in life and you have all the wisdom in you you have all the resources that are around you that's going to help you take that decision and your plans are definitely going to work out very well so why are you waiting just take a decision <laughs> just move, move ahead with that decision 
in your supporting energies again you have queen of ariel so you put both king of ariel queen of ariel the king of pentacle queen of pentacle absolutely a su suggestive sign that it's a power couple that you are dealing with so if any any of you have recently started with a new relationship hold on to that person this is this is your soulmate that we are talking about for sure Mm, if if you if this was more to do with a new business venture or a new job offer that you have recently taken up which resonates with the passion or kindles that passion inside you hold on to that because this is a divine connection that's there for sure because that's that's something that is going to bring a lot of financial stability happiness uh around you and it's going to be more of a practical wise uh, relationship or a partnership that's coming out your your way mm, you've got the you've got the planning aspect of king of pentacles the stability the power and the accomplishment that it he brings in with you and you have also got the mature practical generous and happy aspect of queen of pentacles so it's a it's an absolute divine situation to be in because there's a lot of happiness that's coming your way that happiness is related to materialistic aspects but you know what if i am going to get money to be happy i would rather go for a money to be happy so why not you know everybody is at the end of the day you know work hard so that we are financially stable and everything so why why not why not this is the best practical and beautiful advice that we can get right now i think capricorn this month is absolutely brilliant for you if you have found somebody already hold on to that person because this connection is going to open up door to your financial stability and the financial freedom that you were looking forward to and with that financial freedom it comes with wisdom okay it comes with the wiseness that that needs to be there so it's not just the money that is coming with it it's also the wisdom to sustain that financial stability as well so absolutely brilliant reading uh in your hopes and fears you've got the eight of files so yes uh, there is something better that is waiting for you you are being very hopeful with this card some of you are already on your spiritual quest um follow your instinct you know do what you feel is right for you you already know a lot of answers to your questions it's time probably to take actions move away from the drama and be on your own for some time you know so that all the all the information and clarity comes to you as well final outcome for you you've got the ace of gabriel so two aces ace of gabriel is the you know it's a new beginning with respect to passion opportunities uh, career advancement it's chance to do something amazing uh, it's it's a wonderful new beginning that's happening for you so there is a wonderful new beginning at an emotional level there's a wonderful new beginning at a career job opportunity financial level as well so that's those are two aces two aces with king and queen of pentacles absolutely brilliant reading if this was more to do with your financials right now you are at the top of your game and with the partnership that you are yielded with your soulmate right now you are seriously in top at top of your game so this is the month for you capricorn and i mean this leo season is coming out to be very favorable for you yes you got the eight of wands there are messages and news coming your way so keep looking up for those communication channels keep checking your emails there are some important mess messages that are going to come your way some emails that you might want to see some messages that you might want to see some phone calls that you don't want to miss at all so keep your communication channel open to receive these messages as well brilliant reading capricorn i am really all of this reading a lot of you are getting that financial abundance uh, that you always looked forward to along with your partner you know it's not this sole 
uh, soul happiness that's coming in. It's the collective happiness that's coming your way. So absolutely brilliant reading. Don't forget to watch your sun, moon and rising signs as well to get a better picture. But do make a decision. Okay, if you're waiting for making a decision, do make a decision because it's opening up a big door for you when where it comes to stability wisdom and abundance that's coming your way so thank you so much for listening to me i will see you in the next reading bye bye